Animals eat animals. We don't need to eat animals though, do we? That was the most interesting conversation ever. I've never heard anyone's reach so far. I thought you would know that if you know a lot about but farming. That's the way that we accept for humans to die. We accept humans to die in gas chambers? Here we are, Leicester Square again, London, Burger King behind us. We've got the enriched cage facility here that we exposed for the Uncovered series. And uh, I'm gonna talk to people because enriched cages for eggs are co more common than what you think. Looking at about 36% of eggs are coming from these facilities here. So that's quite a high number considering there's 66 million people in the UK or maybe more by now. But that's quite a lot of uh, hens being exploited in these facilities. And this was one of the most frightening places I've ever been in. It was, you saw how shocked I was in the video. I mean, I was just in complete disarray in there. The hens are just going mad in there. It's just insane. And there's dead birds in the cages. It's just multi-level story, animal exploitation prison it was. And uh, let's see what the public think of it. Do you know what this facility is? That's me in there, by the way. Can you see? Yeah. I don't know. This is a, uh, for eggs. <laughs> in, the, in England, for eggs. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I don't really have any though. Yeah, which is why I don't eat eggs, actually. I don't eat them. Or other animal products because uh, so much cruelty involved. Violence as well. Kind of factory. Factory farm? Yeah, factory. Yeah, bad. It's a factory farm. Factory farm for animals, yeah. Can be bad. They, do they think, you think they can be good? No, really. I'm more in that organic way. Organic? Natural. Natural. Yeah, yeah. because we eat animals. Yeah. Animals eat animals. They do. Yeah. Animals do horrible things to each other. But in the right environment, in yeah. natural environment. We don't need to eat animals though, do we? Uh, yes, we need. We choose to. We choose no, to. We need what? one, one uh, particular um, nutrient. B12. No, I don't know the name exactly now, but one particular protein. Uh, protein is coming only for the blood and can't be. Uh, iron. You mean iron? It's a kind of. It's not iron. It's something. B12. Kind of Combination? No, it's not B12. Yeah, well, it's no iron. I don't remember now. They need to eat. No, 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 not the medical condition. It's a we, nutrient. As a people, we need that. But, but I don't know if well, uh, it's a problem, should I be? I don't what about me? Do, what do you, What do you think about me? Do you think I get that nutrient that, you, that you're talking about? Can't can't be fixed. We can't have from from something else. So, but I'm. You know, I haven't eaten animals. I've been vegan for eight years. Maybe you believe that. No, but I haven't eaten animals for eight yeah, years. Maybe you believe that, but you never know. I never know? Yeah. Sometimes I'm living proof. It. Living proof. No, you don't have to eat the animals. Fact that you can't see an animal on your plate on these days does not mean you don't you don't eat the animal proteins. From where? <laughs> I mean you never know what they mix in. Do you remember the horse meat scandal? What you uh, think they're making putting meat in my vegan food? Yes, can without me knowing that's why I'm not yes. dead. Can be. Otherwise, I should be dead. Can be. No. Okay. No. no. So you won't die from not eating animals, but you uh, might get very that sick. Is like uh, for Ina uh, like bones flowers, which actually is provided even the uh, flowered bone, yeah, like yeah. bone meal. Yeah. So they're putting bones in yeah. my food. That, no, that can be can be put, uh, actually as a um, fertilizer. Yes. So you think the, the plants actually have the nutrient from the bodies can of the be, animals? Can be. We I never know. We you never, never know. know. We so never that's know. why I, I don't have to eat animals. Is because the animals are actually in the plants? Is that the? Can be. Can be. Okay. I'd, I'd prefer to go with like more science-based approach and like most you know, plant-based diets can be healthy for all stages yes, of life. Uh, even in the science, the science can be pushed yeah. on the limit but you can't go over. If you found out that you didn't need to eat, an eat animals, let's just say you found out, would you still eat the animals? I don't know. 
Yeah. I don't know. Okay. I can't say now. How about you? No, if you found out you didn't require animal protein. I'm not in that position, yeah, to have and to be, to know like hundred. What I know is what is double processed, yeah, like food. Yeah. That's dangerous for your oh, body. Of course, it's I understand nothing. that. Yeah. It's actually nothing. We'll make some changes on molecular, you know, level for for generation not for now you will don't feel but if you have the child, the what, child my child's going to be sick yeah that maybe can, yeah you'd that probably can be seen okay on your child. I okay mean, you can never know, especially i mean you never know what what eating animals does to people too but we, we actually we do know anything. we do know because heart disease is the number one killer of people we're talking 17 million people a year die of heart disease saturated fat and cholesterol cholesterol is only found in animal foods only there's no cholesterol in plants so we know that so I'd go with what we do know versus what we don't know and some imagination well, or it's, it's fear. Room, that's why everyone's free to choose. But yeah, uh, it's it's you're free to be cruel choice. to the animals. You are free to do that. Mm -hmm. But like that's why I ask for people's heart conscience. Because you legally can do this to the animals if you want. You can pay for this. But I ask people to use their heart, not just what's legal and what you can do. Yeah, that's true. Mm. We respect that. Bless you. That was the most interesting conversation ever. He literally said, the reason I'm not dead from being vegan is because they're hiding animal products in the vegan food. That's why, that's why I'm not dead. Uh, you know, that, I've never heard anyone's reach so far to go, well, the reason that you're still alive is they're grinding up bits of animal and putting it in your vegan food. And that's why you, you're getting that magical nutrient that's only found in animals. So that was crazy. I took this footage. Home, yeah, I filmed in here. That's me in the in the footage. That was the other night in England. You do realise that not all farms are like that, right? Sorry? You do realise that all farms are not like that, right? Well, 36% of the eggs in the UK come from um, enriched cages. This is an enriched cage barn. If, if it's not all farms, show me the, the good one. Chickens in my garden. Ah, oh, okay. Well, that's not a farm. That's your garden. Oh, you should see my garden, mate. It's close to being a farm. Is it really? It's like 46 types of fruit and veg growing every... Oh, good work. Every inch of space. Good on you. Well, the sad thing is, I don't eat hardly any of it. Why not? Do you eat the animals? I eat, yeah. Of course I eat animals. Why do you eat the animals? So it's not a debate I'm going to have right now. Uh, I don't eat my chickens. I don't eat those chickens. Do you like those chickens? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I buy them, I buy them as pets because I like them as animals. Um, the eggs are just a byproduct of having them. Um, but, yeah, they do a few things for me. They keep the grass down, keep the bugs off the, the so fruit and veg. Animals only are good in terms of like what they can do to serve people? Is that what you think? They don't shouldn't just exist? Well, there's, there's, a, there's a lot of animals that only exist because of people. If we stopped eating them, they wouldn't be here. They would be extinct yeah. faster than, than us killing them. A but lot I, of animals, yeah, of course. I, I grew like, up in the countryside, so I'm... I'm a bit better informed than the average person about the way that the farms work, okay. the byproducts and that. Um, and I think a lot of vegans. What was that? Nothing. A uh, fly. The amount of times I speak to the vegan protesters, and I see them with leather handbags, leather belts, leather shoes. Nah, man. Hello. Nah, but you might be mistaken because some uh, vegan leather looks like leather, but it's not leather. Uh, yeah, that's why I think there's a lot of people who. Oh, you could, but, but let's just say, well, they'd be a hypocrite, but what they're preaching is still correct. But they need to live by what they're preaching. Of course, yeah, I mean, I do. Yeah, of course. But like, I could say, <laughs> some, like, someone could say, do something horrible and then speak out against it. But what they're saying is still right. My personal food issues, yeah. there are certain things that I won't eat. I like don't what? buy any eggs that come from battery farms. Like yeah. the battery farm, these are called enriched cage well, facilities. Enriched cages, I know. That's I, I know battery cages, I, know I don't think. you call it an enriched cage, it's just a little bit of sandpaper. Well, they give this little like scratching yeah, thing. It's yeah. it's and I, I don't buy eggs. So where do, you, where do you buy them from? I get them from my garden. Okay, yeah, but what, do you, what about but bacon? If I was going to buy them, I'd go to the farm shop or the farm's market. Okay, and where do the, so you get all your meat and flesh? I get my meat from the butchers, but like, my thing with meat, I won't eat veal. I, Why? I won't eat veal, I won't eat foie gras, and I won't eat halal. Why is that? Because I've seen the process involved in either raising or killing those animals. And I don't like it. So, well, I've seen the process involved for raising and killing just conventional animals and it's <laughs> no better. I know from experience the majority of farmers raising something like beef cattle 
they put a lot of time and effort. Well, to well, let's sure talk. Those animals live very well. Well, let's talk and about the way, the when they're killed. The majority of them, the, the, the responsible farmers, those animals are killed as quickly and painlessly. Well, the farmers don't kill the animals. The, the slaughterhouse the workers do. But they are killed <laughs> as quickly and painlessly as possible. Uh, you don't know that. I've done that job. No, but you don't know that for sure. I did that job. What? Uh, bolt gunning cows. Yeah. Okay, but you know, uh, you know how pigs are slaughtered. I never did pigs. Well, I'm. But pig, pigs, pigs are pigs are stunned and then bled. They're yeah. So how do they stun them? They stun them and bled. And that's it. No, they don't. Oh, they do, like for a small percentage, but most of them are killed in, uh, they're stunned in gas chambers in the UK. I thought you would know that if you know a lot about but farming. That, that, that's the way that we accept humans to die. We accept humans to die in gas chambers? Def definitely. Gas chambers are used in a lot of places. If people who've done something evil. Okay. Yeah, but the but animals we, but, have done nothing wrong. But, but does that person deserve to suffer with this? I, I don't agree with the difference. I'm just saying, like, they've done something wrong. There's an indictment against them. The pigs have done nothing wrong. How many animals die growing vegan or vegetarian produce? I can answer you that. Go on. But, uh, but... You know that it's more than... You know, you went from the pigs suffering in the chamber to how many animals die in uh, crops. I think that what you're trying to do is avoid the fact that pigs are suffering in gas chambers. And, and, and instead... Right now. Why is that? I see your friend over there filming. I'm yeah, because... I'm happy I'm, to have a debate with you, but I don't like the, the being... But, but why not? Because I don't want to be on YouTube. Yeah, but uh, but I'll, I'll happily debate anything with you. But the whole, the whole game of YouTube thing. I can blow your face, but this is a public space, so if you're going to talk oh, to me I in a public up, area, all right. Listen, best of luck. No, I appreciate it, mate. All right, that was an interesting conversation with that fellow there. Um, he wanted to focus on cows and his backyard hens, but he didn't want to talk about the pigs. As soon as we started talking about gas chambers, he wanted to talk about crop deaths, um, because I fe I feel like once you get them to a point with the like the gas chamber point where pigs suffer and die in. His first thing is to do is to appeal to hypocrisy and uh, go for the crop deaths. He wants to have some type of accusation against you instead of addressing the moral point. But uh, obviously most of the crops, like what do you think pigs are eating? They're eating crops. What do you think cows are eating? They're eating crops. And there's more crop deaths incurred because of meat and dairy and eggs than because of human consumption. So, but anyways, um, supposed to be about enriched caged eggs and uh, just spiraled off into a conversation about humane slaughter with that security guard so anyways we'll keep going this is an egg facility what this is an egg facility in the uk eggs eggs oh, yeah. yeah yeah this is me in there is change that you? The... is that you yeah that's me i see oh it's not like it's against battery farming basically well uh, well this particular topic is today, but I'm against the exploitation and cruelty to all animals. So you're vegan? Yeah. You're vegan, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, what do you think of that? It's fine, it's absolutely yeah. fine. I can't yeah. argue with that. Yeah, because um, when I, the reason I got, went vegan is because I felt like I didn't want to put those animals in this, mm. oh, in this, know, in this suffering, yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So I, I felt it was consistent uh, with my values. Yeah, 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 so yeah. my actions are just consistent with my yeah, values, yeah, what yeah. I believe. Are you against the cruelty to animals? Oh, of course, yeah. yeah. Who, is, who is in favor of cruelty to animals? Well, yeah. most people pay for it, don't they? So that's why I just ask people if they're against it. And if Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. what about in your actions? Are you against cruelty to animals in your actions? You mean? Eating them, yeah, I'm going wearing to say, them. Yeah. I was vegetarian at one time. Yeah. Not now. I don't. I don't know if I eat much meat. I tend to eat fish. Oh, you eat the fishes? I do eat fish. Yeah. Okay. I'm no vegan scan. Can you no. be cruel to a fish? <laughs> do you think? <laughs> I know. I, I, I work with it. Someday I work with cheese vegan. I know what it stands for. You know, it's but, okay. So fish can experience cruelty, I, yeah? I'm sure. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. But so. Yes. If you're eating them, you're kind of yeah, part of that. Yeah yeah yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I mean, it seems like you already know anyway. But oh, I don't know what a vegan's all about. I know what it's all about. Yeah. A lot of people they know, but they don't want to do anything about it. That's a. You do end up with quite a narrow range. For example, you can't eat honey either, can you? Or any kind of milk. Cows don't go to much. You can't eat honey. It's just animal products. I mean, I don't. I choose not to eat honey because of oh, the um, eggs. You can't eat eggs either, can you? No, but I use. So I use tofu so instead of. See, it's quite a narrow range. No, no, it's actually we we yeah. there's more plant foods in the in yeah. the world than there are animals to eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure. You know, yeah, yeah. so you just it's about what is that? Yeah. Ten animal products you don't have to eat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But uh, instead yeah. of eggs, we just use tofu, yeah, 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 yeah. vegan I'm, egg. I'm aware of it. Yeah, yeah. You are. Well, I'm aware of. It. Yeah, I know what it's done. So yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Anyway. Yeah, all right. No worries, buddy. The biggest enemy is not those who kind of come with fierce opposition, it's the apathy. It's the, I know about it, I mean, 
Do I care enough to change? Probably not. You know, that's, the, that's really the enemy of the animals is apathy. People who come up and oppose vehemently, passionately, they're the people who actually care enough to stop and they're having some type of emotional reaction. But other people, they just get this like blasé kind of nonchalant attitude, this, this apathy, that's, that is the reason why things like this can happen. It's apathy. Do people sanction it? to say I was kicking them to make him tender before I ate them. It's always the boyfriend though, more of a harder nut to crack. You watch all my videos, you're not a vegan. Though. You're not the one who's urgently, desperately, you know, pleading for their life.